Ever been on a roller coaster that just won't end? That's been our economy lately, but hold on to your hats. Christopher Waller from the Fed's Board of Governors is whispering sweet. Nothing's about inflation slowing down. Could this be the light at the end of the tunnel or just the headlamp of an oncoming train? So Wall Street's got their crystal balls out and they're seeing a future with rate cuts as early as March. Maybe they also know when I'll finally win the lottery, huh? But our main man Waller is playing it coy, giving us few hints about when the Fed will swipe left on high rates. Our cautious Fed fellow, Waller, is doing the economic tango. One step forward, two steps back. He's looking for more signs that inflation is really heading back to its 2% home. I guess it's a believe-it-when-I-see-it situation, folks. FYI, Chris. My invite to the 2% party is still in the mail, right? Looks like the Fed is adding a new trick to their circus act. They're not just inflation tamers now. They're also employment jugglers. Waller says they're walking this tightrope ever so carefully. Watch your step, Chris. We wouldn't want all those job balls to come tumbling down. And that's a wrap on today's economic soap opera. Will Waller and his Fed buddies give us the rate-cut drama we've been waiting for? Keep your eyes peeled and your wallets ready. Until next time, I'll be here refreshing my banking app every five minutes.